Hey guys, and welcome back to Top 3 and Terrible 3. And this is still a collaboration with Glamour Gossip with Angel. I will have her, her information linked down below. If you haven't checked her out, you need to check her out. She's awesome, and she knows what she's talking about. Now, we decided to do eyeliners. Now, I thought mascaras was definitely my hardest one, I'm not going to lie. But eyeliners was almost just as hard. Um, but like usual, I'm going to start with my bottom three. And one right here, this one's kind of an odd one, just for the simple fact of what subscription box I got this in. This is called Pencil Me In, and it's supposedly a natural formula eye accent pencil. And it's supposed to be in Purple Passion, and it is made in the U.S. Um... Yeah, why would that be coming in a lip subscription box is what I'm curious about. But, you know, it swatches okay. I mean, that's an okay purple. I could, I know of better brands that have done better purple. Um, but um, I even tried this. I wouldn't use this on my eye. I just, I wouldn't. Purple, no, just not my thing. I actually tried this on my eye. And I guarantee you, you cannot tell me which eye it's on. That's because it's okay on swatch, but it's not okay when you put it on your eyes. Now, I've tried putting this on my under eye, and my top lid didn't work. Nothing. It is barely there. But it is on my left eye. And I'm going to, I don't know if you can see it, but it's barely there. And to me, if you're going to have, a, the colors don't even match up to me. So, like, the color swatch and the pencil, it doesn't match up to me. So, yeah, this one's, no. The only thing I liked about this was that it came with its own little sharpener. That's the only thing I liked about it. That was it. Okay, next one. This one is by Ico London. This is their Fat Liquid Eyeliner. Now, I'm not a liquid eyeliner person. So, if I would do something, you know, with liquid eyeliner, I want a thin you know, eyeliner, you know, thing, whatever I'm working with. This thing here, they weren't kidding. That is a fat eyeliner, you know, thingy. I was thinking maybe, you know, I could just like tap it, you know, to create one. Yeah, no, you can't do it with this. I mean, it's pigmented. I'll give it that. It's pigmented. But I can't, I don't know. I don't have the coordination to do something like that. Um, one, I'm a contact lens wearer, so anything near my eyes, I just automatically just start blinking all over the place. This is definitely not my thing. Next one. This is by CoverGirl. This is their from their Ink It line, and the color of this is 240 Aquamarine Ink. Now, this is a pretty color. Don't get me wrong. Very pretty. The issue with it is it's okay on a swatch. Now, and it feels nice and smooth when you do a swatch. When you go to put this on your eyes, oh my God, it hurts. It is pulling, it is tugging, and it's just, it's, it's bad. And I've even poked myself in the eyes. Just, no, this is not good. One, this does not show up in your waterline. And it will show up on your eye, I guess, if you like poking yourself, trying to get it to work. It's just... No, I don't like it. I love the color. I, I mean, that's the reason why I got it was the color. This, no. Not, no. Okay, our top three. This one here, I'll start with a nude liner. This is, I'm pretty sure a lot of people can recognize this one. This is Remmel Scandalize and Nude. I do believe that's what that one was. I do believe it's a nude. Yeah. And I love, I don't use this on my top line. But I do, you probably barely see it. But I use this in my waterline when I'm tired or I really just don't care. And I just need a little pick-me-up on my face. I will use this and some mascara and I'll walk out the door. Maybe with a lip balm, but I'm usually putting the lip balm, lip balm on as I'm walking out the door. Absolutely love this. This is waterproof. Um, if you do have watery eyes, I would be careful with this. I'd maybe set it with, like, you know, maybe a... Uh, uh, what do you call it? A eyeshadow that's similar to this, but you know, I wouldn't say I have watery eyelids, or you know, I know they call it waterline for a reason. 
but if I do too much eyeliner, like if I pull just a little bit trying to do it, it'll all just go away. It doesn't matter if it's waterproof or not. So, but I do like this one. I really do. Next one. My liquid eyeliner. <laughs> I got this in, I think it was my Ipsy bag, I want to say. And this is called Insanely Intense Tattooed Waterproof uh, Eyeliner in Jet Black. And this is from Scone. I hope I pronounced that right. I do believe this is made in Germany if I'm not... Let's see. Oh, I can't find it. But this is exactly what I'm talking about. Thin, you know, I don't know what you would call this, a pin tip, whatever you want to call it. Okay, it's thin. So when you go, you know, all the way around, it's going to be the same length, not length, the same thickness as what you started out with. I love this. And this stuff, let me tell you, it is pigmented. Between this one and the Ico, I, I can't tell the difference. Except that the Ico is really, really, is a lot thicker than what... The tattooed one is. I, I absolutely love this one. This is my go-to liquid liner. I know a lot of people like the ones from the drugstore. I didn't like the NYC and I didn't like the, um, was it Wet n Wild that came out with one? I don't remember, but I, I just, I can't stand it. I stick usually with gel eyeliners unless I absolutely have to have a liquid liner. Now, this one I love. I talk about this one quite a bit. This one's from Maybelline. This is their Lasting Drama Waterproof Gel Pencil. And this one is in Lustrous Sapphire. I also like their um, Black Onyx, I think is what it's called. Same line, everything. I absolutely love that color. It is a really pretty blue. I, I really did like that one. But you know what? They came out with more colors and everything. I already have a shopping list. I am going out soon to go get some more. But I absolutely love it. This is what's in my waterline now. And I don't know if you can, you know, you know, not unless I put my whole face all up in the camera. But I love this color. I could do a little more. Yeah, I. you know what? I think it came off at the right time to be honest with you and you're probably like what the hell are you talking about my camera just died right at, right as i said i need a little more because <laughs> my camera said nope you don't need no more honey i'm just kidding but anyway <laughs> i just switched out batteries but that was pretty much it i will have these linked below um i will also have um angel's um information linked below so you can go and check her out um you definitely get two different points of view when it comes to makeup, like me, I'm combination. Her, she's oily. So, I mean, she, if you have oily lids or anything of that nature, she would definitely be able to help you out more than I can. Um, but, you know what? Hey, you get tons of choices with these kinds of videos. So, I hope you enjoy. And I will see you in my next video, which should be tomorrow. And... I'm hoping to have a major haul for you. So, stay tuned to see what, what kind of goodies I got in the mail. See you later, guys. Take care. Bye-bye.